Can we just can we just start this? Can we just start this from the beginning? So we can see the proof. So we can see the proof. This is, in fact, licensed by Nintendo. Licensed by Nintendo. What's going on, shady people? Shady Penguin here, welcoming you to. I don't know what the heck this is. Yu-Gi-Oh! Dark Duel Stories. While I was in LA, uh, Nate bought me this game for 25 cents, and I remember it being the absolute. It was my childhood. It was my childhood. So I thought I'd share a piece of my childhood with you guys today. This is something completely different. I'm gonna hit new. Delete save. Oh, Yugi looks so serious. Yes, I would like to delete the save data. Oh God. Okay, here we go. <clears throat> Welcome to the world of Yu-Gi-Oh. Dark Duel Stories. Before you start, input your dual name. Okay, so we have a dual name right here. Here we go. We are freaking shady. So this game, if you don't know anything about this game, you should stick around. If you know something about Yu-Gi-Oh and you don't know anything about this game, you should stick around. This game is on the Game Boy Color right now. I'm playing it on um, my Super Game Boy for Nintendo GameCube, rocking out with this. And oh my gosh, okay. All right, we're just gonna jump. You can change your name. We're gonna jump right into the campaign. Okay, so when you're thrown into the campaign, is this laggy or? Okay, so down is the only way you go. You only go down or up. Uh, we're gonna start with Tristan. Hiya, my name's Tristan. You've gotta win five times, you Oh God. <laughs> You've gotta win five times. Let's just do it. Let's see what they give us. Oh my gosh, look at this game. <laughs> Shady's turn. All right, we have Sinister Serpent, Mystery, Buku, Abyss Flower, and Mylas Ra. We're gonna go, we're gonna go hard, man. We're gonna, we're gonna start out with the Abyss Flower. And we're gonna place it. Oh no, I don't wanna place it over there. We're gonna place it right here. Bam. Can I summon more things? No, okay, it won't let me summon more things. Okay, I was kind of hoping I would. I'm gonna hit B to end my turn. Tristan's turn. We have 8,000 life. This is ridiculous. Defense mode! Are you kidding me? What do we draw? White dough. All right. I know there's a way to fuse randomly. Like, look, if we just do this. No, I'm scared of doing that. All right. Let's, let's just summon you. Now let's attack. We're attacking right now. Oh, that steel scorpion is gone. That steel score. I can't believe we have 8,000 life points. We're attacking with our mystery hand as well. Oh, the damage! The da this is this is unreal. I can't believe I'm doing this right now. Uh, Tristan's turn. All right. So there's a way to like just randomly fuse monsters. I think that's what I remember. I kind of remember that. Or maybe you can just use polymerization once you get it on like anything. I don't know. We're gonna try. What does special mean? Card effects can't be activated. Okay. Do you have an effect? Card effect can't be activated. Okay, so certain cards have effects. We just don't know what they are. You just have to guess. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. You just have to guess. What about you? Okay, let's 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 fuse you with you. Or did that just replace you? It just it just destroyed my own creature without. Oh my! All right, let's attack. Let's attack. I thought that it would fuse or something. Oh, swordsman, you're done. Swordsman, you're done. I think. I think we unlock cards when we win at some point. Maybe. I. I, I I don't know. I don't know. Let's end our turn. I really don't know. Tristan's turn. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Okay. More defense mode. All you've been doing is defense mode, Tristan. That's it. Oh, okay, here we go. Here we go. Since we, since the fuse the fusing doesn't work. The fusing doesn't work. We're gonna have to just we're just gonna have to power through. We have to we have to get the polymerization card, like right now. We really do. We really do. Cause that's like the best part of the game. Also in Dark Duel Stories, there's like weaknesses. So if you're a fiend, you're weak to light. And it, it's it's basically Pokemon guys. It belongs on the channel. It's basically Pokemon, uh, 100%. What is Tristan gonna do? More defense mode, that's it. We're going right to Yugi after this. We're going right to Yugi after this. Oh my gosh, this is so bad. All right, here we go. Do you have a special ability? This monster has no special effect. Wait, so other ones do. Card effect can't be activated. So these guys have effects, they just can't be activated. Okay. All right. That's it. Flowey's been doing a good job destroying Tristan's life. So we're gonna go ahead and we're just gonna keep, we're just gonna keep keeping on. 300 life points left Tristan and Flowey is going to do the job. I think the craziest part about this game. All right, did we win? We win, right on. This time you get a card and a card part for construction. 
You won, so you get a card part. And you get Book of Secret. Oh, Book of Secret Art. Powers up non fiend magic users. Only magic users. How do you know what a magic user is? I really have no idea. That's it. We're jumping right to Yugi. I'm Yugi. Nice to meet you. Let me explain a few things. Collect cards and parts by dueling. There are duelists at every stage. You have to beat each one five times. That's how you advance. Well, let's duel, man. Shady's turn. All right, we get to start again. All right, I wonder how strong. Oh, we have a 700 beater? Oh my goodness, 700 beater. I think the craziest thing about this game is to make you verse the same people five times in a row. That's nonsense. You know how long that duel took that I chopped up? All right, this wind. This wind. Oh, you're done. You're done, change saw. You're done. All right, we're going to win this in 10 turns max. 10 turns max. It's freaking Jabba the Hutt on our screen right now. I'm excited. I love Jabba. He's a good guy. I don't know if you guys just saw that, but it didn't even show his defense points because I was Aqua and his monster was fire. Yes! Oh, that's brilliant. That is awesome. All right, so we should be good on the next turn. Man, I, I can't believe. So I, originally what I wanted to do with this game was just do a one of, and of course I'm going to just... <laughs> Just do one, but I wanted to introduce a new series, uh, a new series idea to the channel uh, called Trash or Cash. And basically, I would play random games for a little while, like an hour or so, and then turn them into like 20 minute episodes and let you guys know if the game is trash or cash. So if you have any game suggestions that you think would fit that mold, they could be Steam games, they could be whatever kind of games you want. Um, man, okay, so we don't have anything that's worth summoning, so let's just let's use Job of the Hut to finish this up. Pot the blank. Just pot the blank. Uh, let me know in the comment section below, of course. I mean, this is this will be a fun thing to do, for sure. Uh, I'm bringing some new stuff to the channel, in case you guys don't know. There's going to be some new stuff in addition to our Pokemon content. Uh, my lip is so swollen, I don't know if you guys can tell that. I've been biting it so much. Like, accidentally, not on purpose. I don't chew my lips. Um, if you do, I mean, totally, that's totally you. That's fine. Gee, I lost. Pretty good. Did you know I beat my dark half? And Pegasus, too. Not bad, huh? Well, then why did you, I just beat you? I want a card part. And you get a black pendant. Ooh, powers up shadow magic users. How fun. Let's verse Joey. I'm Joey, the school's second best duelist. If you want to face the best, what is this accent? That's not Brooklyn. He's from Brooklyn. Okay, we're going right into the duel. Obviously, our deck is OP, and we don't have to worry about a darn thing. They gave me the most OP deck in the game. Can I attack on turn one? Okay, I can't. I was going to say... If I can attack on turn one, that's pretty broken. Use sparks! Opponent loses life points! I lost 50 life points from a card. Oh, Use Muyan Curry! Recover life points! He's at 82! Joey's using magic cards! This guy cheats! The worst magic cards I've ever seen in my life. All right, let's go ahead and summon this masked. Oh my gosh, HID. What does HID mean? Shadow hid. What is hid? Do I have an ability? Does that mean I have an ability? Special. This monster has no special. Never mind. Okay, we're gonna swing with our 500. You don't have a, you don't have a good defensive monster. Queen's blank. I love that you don't even get to see the entire name of the card. You're just forever knowing. As a child, I forever knew that card is just queens. Just queens. Freaking queens. Oh my gosh. This game. This game. I don't. I mean, if I had to pick a side right now, trash or catch. Muyan Curry. More life points. He's using his whole hand. He's losing hand advantage and board advantage. He's he's not he's not the best. Ooh, wretched! It's the evil Karibo. He's got a 600 attacker. Can I get over that? I can. I have Buku. Yes, Buku. Actually, I should have checked what type he was. Earth. I could have tried like I don't know what beats Earth. Forest? Does Forest beat Earth? I really don't know. I don't know the type of, I don't know the type chart in Yu-Gi-Oh! Dark Duel Stories. I really don't. If someone wants to let me know in the comment section below, that'd be grand. How many of you guys played this game? Did you play this game? I don't know. I don't know the age group of the people watching this video. If you never did, um, give it a go. No, the point of this series is let me know if you should waste your time playing a game. If you actually enjoy Yu-Gi-Oh! Uh, you might get a kick out of playing this because nothing follows the same rules. But other than that... Oh, what did I just do? I just like moved one card from what? Oh man. I basically replaced a card in my hand with a card in my hand. Ooh, Hain Hain. Oh, Hain Hain's supposed to send something back to my hand, is he not? 
Is he not? Is that not what Hain Hain does? Well, we didn't get to max out our field this turn, so I guess we're just gonna wait till he finishes duel. All right, Jabba Jabba, you can Jabu Jabu, Jabu Jabu, Jabba the Jabba the Jabu Jubu. You can finish this one. Down goes Joey. One day I'm gonna be the best. I'll duel until that day comes. You won, so you get a card part and you get Yamad Yamadron Ritual. Ooh, all for Mountain Warrior, etc. It's card number 666, and you offer the Mountain Warrior, etc. All right, so what's my card parts? Where are my card parts? All right, I have one rabbit. Wait, what? I don't remember this at all. I can make a bird. Are these all the cards? So then I wanna, if I wanna construct, So I keep going. Ruby eyes plant, ruby eyes sort, ruby eyes race, ruby eyes lizard. What is going on? I can't do any of these. I can't do any of these. What? All right, so that's a complete waste of time. Let's go ahead and go, let's, let's do another freaking duel. Let's, let's, let's duel my Valentine. Around here, I'm called Mai. I'm good with the har Harpy Lady cards. If you can beat my Harpy Lady sisters, I'll let you go on ahead. I can't believe they expect you to beat these people five times. Mai's turn. Mai gets to go first? Use electric whip, power up key mace. Oh, we lose. We definitely lose. We, I can't see us winning this. She used a magic card, an actual good one. Well, good is relative, but you know what I'm saying. The shadow monster beat the light monster without checking stats. Yes. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. This game is something else, folks. This game is, we're using our shadow monster again. Let's do it. Queens? She wasted her whip. She wasted it. The whip has been wasted. That's it. It's over. It's done. It's freaking, it's a rap. It's rap city. Rap city. It's rap city. It's over. I don't know what I'm saying anymore. All right. Light just defeats Fiend. Oh, man. Okay. Okay. All right. Hold the phone. Hold the phone. Light just outright defeats you. I want to make sure I do damage. Wait, we can't use a fiend. Don't use a fiend. I almost used a fiend on the key mace. I would have lost that one. Oh, that would have been bad. All right, we're good. We're good. We're back in. We're back in control. We're back in control. Holy crap! How is this fair? 1690. So it turns out that if I attack this 1690 harpy lady with this spider, I kill it because forest beats wind. In this universe, somehow, Forest beats Wind. I don't know how, I don't know why, but I sure am glad that that worked out for us. Did I even, I don't even think I summoned anything that turn. It doesn't even matter. Forest beats Wind! And she goes down. Mm, I guess I had to lose some time. I don't think that will happen again. You won, so you get a card part. And you get Malevolent Nuzzler. Powers up female and shadow monsters. <laughs> Oh man, this game is ridiculous. All right, let's take on, uh, I think his name is Meku. I am Mako, Mako, the sea duelist. My attacks are like a tidal wave. You'll never beat me five times. Now I'm wondering, oh gosh, not chest. I'm wondering if when you verse the person a second time, do they actually get stronger? Well, I'll find out for you guys before we wrap this one up. 1,000 defense, Aqua, okay. I think Thunder will beat Aqua. I'm pretty sure Thunder will just destroy Aqua. Yes! Oh my gosh! Weaknesses are great. Stats are irrelevant when you have random weaknesses. I love it. Oh my gosh. I feel like Kaminari is just going to destroy Ma Mako's entire deck. Now I have Starboy all of a sudden. Okay, apparently I think I found, I think Shadow Spectre and Swordsman. If I do this and that, fusion of Swordsman from a f <laughs> and Shadow Spectre created Zombie Warrior. 
freaking beater! Oh, you're done, man. I can't summon him yet, though. Shoot, I can't summon him yet. All right, that's fine. That's fine. He already switched into attack position like a fool anyway, so... I think we're good. I think we're good. Another the melt? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Another melt. Well, we have our we have our zombie warrior in hand. This fantastic fusion. Oh my goodness, this game. This game is ridiculous. Starboy! Wait, did I have a Shadow Spectre on the field? Oh, I probably could have just dropped it and feel and fused then. Oh well. Oh well. Oh man, we gotta try out so many different. Let's see, this is a 550. We could beat a 550 with this. But I don't think he'll lose life points. Oh, he does still. Even though we even though we beat it no matter what. He still loses life points. Oh, and we have a zombie warrior now. It's over. It's over! I just did this randomly. Fusion of Jin Milus Radiant and Jinzo number seven created Gigatech Wolf. Look at this! This wasn't even in the strategy guide that I was looking up. Oh my goodness! All right, that's awesome. That's another great, beautiful fusion to feature. Uh, I think we're good on this front. I think Ma Meku, Mako, Meko, Meko is gonna just get destroyed by our zombie warrior. So, if you're new to Dark Duel Stories, fusions are everything, because you can see you start out with complete garbage cards. Ah, I lost, it ain't possible. Next time you're gonna be fish bait. And you gotta you do your random fusions in order to proceed through this game. We got a penguin soldier! Penguin soldiers attack as a group! Yeah, we do. That's the shady people. Oh my gosh. All right. We're gonna go ahead. I'm gonna do one more. I versed all of these guys once so far. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and, and verse Yugi one more time. Every used parts to construct a card? Forget I said that and let's duel. Oh, okay. Let's just duel. I wanna see if it got any harder. I'll let you guys know in a bit. Cyber Steam! Look at this card art! Oh my gosh! Now I know Cyber Steam can do some fusions. I know! The only one I see is Cyber Steam and a white dolphin, and we don't have a white dolphin right now. I kinda wanna just try one anyway, but I'll lose field advantage if I do that. So let's go ahead and let's just summon Cyber Steam. We'll fuse with him later. Let's use freaking Pelican Boy to take out the Magician of Faith! And deal another, what, 1400? Oh! That's big damage right there, boys! No! The light defeated my Cyber Steam! Why? I guarantee I'll, uh, I thought I was gonna draw the white golf. White Dolphin. Okay, what what fused with the Swordsman again? Was it Lagool? Let's try it. Yes! Fusion of Lagool and Swordsman from a F created Cockroach Knight! No! <laughs> that's not a re is that a real card? No way. Oh my gosh, that's awesome. Well, wasn't a, as good a fusion as I hoped for, but it's it's a new one. It wasn't on the guide, so that's kind of cool. I like that. It's pretty fire. All right, let's go ahead and uh, end our turn. So I can definitely confirm that the second time is no harder than the first time you face uh, one of the characters on the first screen. Of course, you have to beat them five times, which is quite tedious, and then you can advance to the next set of characters that you have to play. So obviously the campaign is just a simple click the face and beat them, kind of like a lot of the Yu-Gi-Oh games were until the Game Boy Advance. Uh, we just got the Tura Purin! Wields a wicked trident. Oh my gosh, that card art is great. But I think that's gonna be it for this, uh, this video. If you guys enjoyed this, show some shady love down below. Uh, trash or cash? So I would say the nostalgia factor uh, makes this game cash and the hilariously bad uh, hilariously bad mechanics of type advantages and what have you make it make it uh, a little bit a little bit trashy, a little bit cashy. The random fusions, complete cash, 100%. Overall, I'd say if this was on mobile, if this was on my phone, I'd probably play it all the time. So we'll give it a cash rating this time around. Thank you guys so much for watching. Have yourselves a good day. But above all else, keep it shady.